here there is a room, which is a room uh, that uh, is a little bit a copy of what we have in Virgo. So you see, first of all, the prototype of an interferometer. When the gravitational wave comes, these mirrors that we try to keep at uh, the best possible start oscillating. And this oscillation we see it as a modulation of the interferometric signal. And all these screens show what we see in the control room. You see, for instance, how we are careful to follow the earthquakes and the sea activity and the meteorological conditions. As we say, everything that has mass affects these interferometers. Only engines don't do it because they don't have mass. So we, you have all these, and you have this very nice thing here. You have uh, uh, one of our scientists who took, every time we have a detection, an alert, we give it to the whole world. What he does, he takes a painting by Rafael, takes a random color, and when we know what happened, something happened, we know where in the sky this happened. So he goes and paints with a brush the place in the sky where this thing happened. So we call it gravitational wave brush. It is a poetic way, and you see, for instance, we see one black hole per week. Black hole event or neutron star event per week. 